It was a beautiful Wednesday in Marble Bar, the hottest town in Australia. Wildflowers are blooming everywhere. Woof woof, dingoes barking from a distance. Kookaburras chirping, cicadas singing, and playful platypuses playing around in the streams of the river. They are feeling excited, energetic, and encouraged to explore the outback. Bouncing kangaroos hopping around, koalas climbing and chewing on the juicy eucalyptus leaves, grass turning yellow, dingoes barking. In just one night, there was a sudden forest fire, piping, glistening hot, disruptive, blazing fire everywhere, so terrifying. The wind carried the fire into the air, creating an updraft. It caused the fire whirl. All the animals were trying to evacuate of the fire, but the fire was spreading. Cucumbers scrambled out of the trees. Cicadas hid under the soil. The fire whirl started to get closer as it picked up speed. Koalas grabbed eucalyptus leaves, climbed down the trees as fast as they could, horrified, panicking, nervous. They were in a hurry and feeling really sad because they had to leave their beautiful leafy paradise behind. But Platypuses swam upstream, feeling nervous and scared. Lots of sad thoughts in their heads, thinking about their family, friends, their homes, and their neighbors. What is going to happen? The kangaroos gathered together and collected all their dogs to hop to a safer place. The dingo continued barking louder to warn the other animals. Then he left in a hurry to find people to help them. The platypus were so scared and confused. They were funny. In all different directions until they heard from Shine the Koala. Shine the wise leader koala could see high above the other animals. When he climbed a tree that was far from the fire. The kookaburra flew away from the forest to find people to help. He found a bucket and he could Try feel it in the river. Um, when he tried to pick up um, the bucket of water in his beach, it spilled out. Shine saw another forest that far away that looked safe, but there was a lake in front of it. They were. Worried about how they could get through the lake to the safer forest far away from the fire. Shine the koala had an idea. She shouted, Let's... Shine the koala had an idea. She shouted, Let's gather together at the edge of the lake. The animals rushed back to the bush. Kangaroo put shine on her back and jumped as fast as she could to the edge of the lake. Shine told the animals they would build a raft and make a bridge to cross the lake to a safe place. The animals worked together to find to get supplies. Platypus went to find wood, but little Joey gathered some supplies. Kookaburra gathered leaves with her beak. The animals were nervous and terrified as the fire was burning. Shine shouted, hurry up, kangaroo. Cried, we are working as fast as we can. The fire raged on and was coming closer. The animals could feel the heat on their fur as it was so close. The animal worked even hard. Kangaroo and platypus shout, everyone, 
everybody jump on. The baby Joey jumped on. The kookaburra, cicada, dingo, snake, and koala jumped on the raft. Platypus and kangaroo pushed and kicked until the raft was on the lake. Platypus swam beside the raft, and kangaroo jumped on just in time. As they sailed across the lake, they saw the fire at distance. Everybody felt safe. Suddenly, there was a splash. The baby Joey had jumped out into the lake. Help! Screamed the baby Joey. The animals were anxious and worried. Platypus swam to rescue the the baby Joey. Kangaroo put her tail in the water, and Joey pulled himself up onto the raft. The animals made a new house together. The koala jumped. The animals made a new home and a new plan, and a new community. Shine helps all the animals to have a good day, but the animals still miss their family. But they have a great day with Shine the koala, and they laugh and play, and they make new community and. They find new friends and make new family. Then they have a lot of fun. They eat a lot of things. Shine the koala find some some food for him to eat, and then he and everybody has a great day. The end. Then Kookaburra flew to their old forest. Then Kookaburra saw the forest burning, but while the forest burned, the fire stopped with the water coming from the other side. There were tons of people pouring water all over the place. Then Kookaburra said, "Hooray! Hooray! Hooray!" The Kookaburra goes back to their community, and the Kookaburra tells her friends what she saw. Now the fire is gone," said Kookaburra, and the animals cheered. And the platypuses backflip, and kangaroos and joy jump high as they can. Finally, they decided to celebrate their new home with lots of food and snacks. Shine the koala picked eucalyptus leaves. Kangaroo and Joey picked bananas from the banana tree. Kookaburra picked berries and nuts, and Dingoes picked coconuts. Lastly, platypuses gathered shrimps. All the animals met on the grass, and they show. They all showed what they. Rot and all the animals ate really full and had a fun time, and they lived happily ever after.